Our top story this evening, the 31st Modern Olympics have opened in Rio with a spectacular ceremony at the Maracanã Stadium. Around 10,000 athletes from more than 200 countries paraded before the enthusiastic crowd. Our Shin Semin reports from Rio. Bringing the world together under the umbrella of sports, the curtain to the 2016 Rio Olympics parted on Friday evening at the Maracanã Stadium. Sportsmen and women from around the globe marched through the stadium to watch a grand fireworks display that lit up the sky. Leading up to the opening ceremony, excitement had been building among the international visitors, filling the streets and corners of Rio. Uh, we just couldn't find any tickets together, so uh, we just thought if we can't get tickets, might as well be out here just to be around the atmosphere and celebrate Team USA. With my father attended the Olympic Games in Berlin in 36, so it, it's in a way an honor. And he himself, like myself, was a citizen of the world. We are not a flag of Brazil, a flag of Germany, or from America, or from uh, uh, Korea, but I think we all are citizens of the world, and that's how I like to see myself. <laughs> Preparations for the ceremony meant the Rio city government closed off almost 40 streets around the Maracana Stadium for nearly a full day on Friday. With visitors from around the world, including high-ranking officials and leaders in Rio for the curtain raiser, additional security forces were deployed, tripling the number of safety personnel. Marking the official start of the Games, the Olympic torch arrived at its final destination to ignite the cauldron. With citizens from all corners of the world bonding through the Rio Olympics, audience members and sports enthusiasts now hope that one of the largest international sporting events go through smoothly, bringing sound results for all. Shin Semin, Arirang News, Rio de Janeiro.